Okay, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can find the funding fees and commission fees that charge by Binance when you are using future trade on Binance. First of all, I would like to invite you to subscribe my YouTube channel. It's all about crypto. So uh, let's jump back to the uh, our topic. So first, you need to go to your Binance app and you need to click on the futures. So after touch on the futures, you will see if you are having any open orders here. So also if you are, if is there any no open orders for here, so it doesn't matter. Even you can check your commission fees that already charged by Binance. So first you need to go to future here and the, you need to click on this, uh, this a small history icon on top right corner. So after cl clicking that you need to scroll right, uh, scroll right to trade history uh, and transaction history. This is the place that you need to select uh, and move. So this is transaction history and these are the transaction histories that uh, my open trade, uh, open last open trade. So it's, you can see this is a commission. Commission means the commission that charged by Binance to holding the position. And this is the realized PNL. It's, it's been, it's already uh, in move to stop loss. So that's the reason. So this is the commission is the uh, Binance charge. And also there is a things called funding fee. So funding fee is uh, some kind of a fee that charged by Binance to uh, to hold the pos hold a position so if you are funding fees as too much negative it's mean uh, it's mean um, uh, sellers need to pay buyers so if the funding fees too much positive it's mean buyers need to pay the sellers funding fees so that's why some funding fees are in the green it's mean plus and some funding fees as are in uh, red in negative so that's the main reason so that's the reason for red and green here and also thank you so much for guys for guys watching this video and don't forget to subscribe i hope you get something from this